20 years ago, the bodyguard took hundreds of millions of pounds worldwide and created what was then the best-selling soundtrack of all time. It also had filmgoers weeping bucket loads for the doomed love story of Whitney Houston and Kevin Costner. So, the West End stage version has a lot to live up to when it opens tomorrow, as our entertainment correspondent, Lucrezia Millerini, now reports. It was her acting debut, featuring one of her biggest hits. Starring the late Whitney Houston alongside Kevin Costner, The Bodyguard was the second highest grossing film of 1992, but its soundtrack remains one of the best selling albums of all time. Now those songs form the basis of the Bodyguard musical, with Broadway star Heather Headley and London actor Lloyd Owen. So how was this for you to take on this role in the singing? And, different you know, world, yeah, yeah, completely different world. And the and the audiences are totally different too, which have been and they've been really um, energetic and up on their feet from from you know early on, and uh, I've really got a kick out of that. It's been hugely enjoyable. Yeah, stepping in the sh into the shoes of Kevin Costner as well. Yeah, he's size seven, and I'm, so they're, they don't, they're a bit tight for me, the shoes, but um, I'm trying my best. Heather, what was it like playing this part? Because it obviously was made famous by Whitney Houston, not just the part, but also her songs as well. It's a daunting, daunting task, and I have high shoes to fill. Um, so um, it, it's quite daunting. You know, she's really had one of the most amazing voices I think we've ever maybe had the privilege to hear. When she sang it, I always say it's, really, you know, she painted like a Picasso. It was like a perfect portrait. I remember hearing it for the first time and stopping where I was, like, who's that? What's that? Um, and so, yeah, it is a challenge to make sure that it's right. Don't worry, I'll protect you. Despite Whitney's death earlier this year, the musical Six Years in the Planning was never meant as a tribute, but for her fans, it offers a nightly memorial that's already selling tickets up to next April. When Whitney was alive, we really wanted to get it right because we knew that, you know, this was great. You know, of course, we're going to use her music. But in the passing, I've also felt um, an even just a higher calling. But I think at the end, the audience is fine with it. They've been OK. I'm still in the country. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't been kicked, you you haven't kicked me out yet. <laughs> My visa is still OK, I think. So, um, so, so far, so good. Heather Headley, the actress who plays Whitney Houston in The Bodyguard, ending that report. A reminder now.